I love Rui Boss. Okay, so first of all, this kitchen is, have we not paid our bills or something? What is going on here? The lighting looks weird to me. Are our bills shut off? Hmm. Turn on all lights. Oh, all our lights were off. Okay. <laughs> um, they're continuing to go back to school after spring break in my school district in Arizona. Uh, here in Arizona, when you stream, it's normally 1 or 2 a.m. I don't want to sound selfish, but I would advise you start a bit earlier. Anyway, how are you doing? I'm so hyped to be here. Yeah, I'm actually going to be changing up the stream times, uh, mixing it up a bit, because I'm not sleeping after streams as well, because I'm so like hyper and I usually stream at night for me. So I'm thinking of changing it to Australian mornings. Hi, Deli and Chat. I've been thinking about the name Megsilaneous. What do you think? Does it make sense? Makes sense to me. I'm good, thanks. Uh, I'm, yeah, I'm good. I'm really excited to be streaming. Now, the kitchen and mom's room situation, I feel like we need to fix this baby daddy photo wall. And I'm thinking we actually really focus a little bit on mom because, you know, she's been working hard pumping out these kids. She needs a little sacred area of her own. Like, I don't know if there's any mums in chat right now. I'm assuming there is. You have to have a little bit of me time and a bit of a reward for looking after the kids. Dad's too. So this is gonna be mum's room over here. And I'm actually thinking I might use one of these custom content beds that we can hopefully with the handiness skill make a bit better. Mum here, so true, yeah. Mama Cedar needs some self-care, yo. That's right, oat milk. <laughs> mm. Yes, me time is key. Absolutely, we all need some me time. So let's get a nice, um, let's get a nice bedroom for her. I'm thinking some calm, cool colors, you know? I'm thinking some soft blues or greens. What other colors do I have here? I'm not really feeling any of these. I mean, that's quite nice. Do we have any other options? I feel like we need a lot more beds. I'm still not satisf satisfied with our bed situation. Uh, or maybe I could just go with one of these ones. I mean, that's a nice blue. Let's just go with this one. This isn't even custom content. Uh, let's just rearrange a few of these things, okay? Now let's get a couple of nice bedside tables. We don't need to go too expensive. I love these ones from the backyard stuff back. I also really like this. I feel like Mama Sita has been to Ikea and got herself a couple of nice bedside tables. She's going to have uh, some nice lights next to her bed, some matching lamps I think will make her feel kind of organized and feel good. But the idea for Mama Sita is that she has a relaxed environment to go back to when she needs to retreat from all of her 100 babies. <laughs> and she also needs to make a little bit of loving in here. You know, this is where some romance is gonna happen. So maybe we should put the romantic decor, except I really don't like that red light. The red light, ooh. Actually, can you have the red light there and enable the aura to change their mood, but not have the light on? Because that, that could be a good idea. Are you redoing the house? Just renovating a bit. We don't have that much money. We love an Ikea shopping spree. We so do. Uh, you should get a bath, a shower bath combo. We should, yeah, Rabina, good idea. Uh, Rachel, oh, Rachel, I know, right, maybe, has gifted a sub to Kay Brooks. Thank you so much, Rach. Azile, thanks for subscribing. And Kay Brooks, welcome to the Pickle family. Shay32, thanks for, some, for subscribing. You could dim the flirty light. That's true, we could dim it. She needs her own spa. I mean, we can't, we can't go too crazy with, um, spending yet, but ideally, yes, yeah, she should have her own day spa. I think we could have this. Maybe some nice flowers next to the bed. You should get them a dog. 
We can't get a dog because it'll take up our precious baby making space. It's a nice idea though. There you go, she can have some flowers next to her bed. <gasps> Maybe mama can get into yoga. Maybe. Although what what does that do for her? Like is that going to make life a little easier? I'm just trying to remember what moodlets it gives you. Okay, so this is where she can put all of the baby daddies over on this wall. We were collecting birth certificates, but like half the time they don't really show up. I don't know why. Like one time we didn't get a birth certificate, I don't think. Um, so happy I'm catching you now because I work night shift and I'm always working when you go live and your stream is usually over by the time I get off work. So yay, yay! I'm glad a lot of you guys have made it today who can't usually make it. It's really nice. Yay, we get a nice window here. Uh, Ali Hyde, thanks for the 100 bits. Get a fish, we could get a fish. We, we could get a hot tub, but you guys, our funds, you know, we've only got 8,000 simoleons. We can't go too crazy. Mama Sita needs the basics first. <laughs> I love how I've ended up calling her Mama Sita. This is Mama Sita's shrine. Everything is gonna be beautiful in her shrine because she deserves the best. You know, pushing out babies. Oh, maybe she can have like this kind of, this kind of thing. Also, I'm not happy with the window situation over here. So let's go like that. It's beautiful. The woohoo in front of all the baby daddy's photos. Yeah, so she can woohoo here and be like, remembering all of her woohoo times with other simps. It brings back a lot of beautiful memories. <laughs> it's kind of disturbing, isn't it? I'm also thinking that we need <laughs> some other lighting in here. There we go. Um, so this is the mother, Mama Cedar room. We could probably extend it a little bit too. I'm thinking we need a little, maybe her own little ensuite. Technically this was her ensuite or could be her ensuite but we'll put a little wardrobe maybe over here. So she can, you know, get dressed, feel organized and good in the morning. <laughs> That's what we want. Maybe we can just use this one. Little Ikea moment. Uh, this one's a little much, I feel. Why is my mom messaging me? Uh. I don't know. She was sending me a picture of a torch. <laughs> Can each kid get a pet like a fish hamster? Justin K, are you trying to kill me of stress? I'm not sure if you've been watching this challenge, but trust me, the kids are already crazy. <laughs> if we get a pet as well. Lord save me. <laughs> it is a nice idea there. Um, Minor is so 98, thanks for subscribing. Aww, Tia, that's so sweet. Uh, I'm glad I could finally catch a stream. I'm in the middle of the Corona madness. Oh, I lost my job and I'm starting to get anxious about being in my apartment by myself all the time now. Aww. Hey, Renny. I'm so sorry to hear about your job. That does sound really stressful. And I think, you know, it's normal to be stressed when there's a lot of change and like, the world is dealing with something new. Like, that's scary. So I totally feel for you. I think the nice thing to know is that, you know, we're all in the same boat. We're all in this together. And um, I think that when you're in an apartment by yourself, as someone who spent a lot of time by myself, uh, I think keeping busy and doing like a to-do list or saying these are some tasks I want to get through, having music or the TV on or a podcast to keep you company, socializing online, um, those are really good things. So I think watching streams and chilling out is good. I'm glad to be here as well to help out a bit. So you're not by yourself because you got me and everyone else here. And there's a lot of people here. There's like 900 people, so that's pretty good. 
Um, Jacob, can you please add the fish from the Friends Let's Play? I forgot his name. Was it Marvin or Martin? Oh, that's nice, Miller. Uh, putting get together wardrobe so she can wear her. Okay, that's a good idea. I don't know why I didn't think of that. Oh, I didn't do that because it's expensive. 730, worth it for the woohoo. Definitely worth it for woohooing. <gasps> by the way, there was an update to the kitchen pack um, by Felix and Harry, and I'm so keen because they've put in light wood swatches. And you guys know me, you know I love a, a light wood swatch. Are you gonna cheat the room for micro bonus? No, I don't think so. Hey, Renny, thank you so much for subscribing. And Kija Sora, welcome guys to the pickle family. Oh, please don't switch streams to early in the morning for your NZ subs. I, I'm going to have to try and get an, a healthy balance for to just for me, and then for as many viewers as possible. So I'm thinking we're gonna do a mix of like afternoons and mornings, probably. I'll mix it up. I'll mix it up for us. All I know is the world needs a lot of deli streams and I am here to provide you with the goods. <laughs> it is my job too. Okay, so we've got Mama Cedar's room. I'm also thinking we could have a nice little chair in the corner. Uh, Jay Garcia, I loved your video earlier today. Thank you. I didn't run out of toilet paper, it's all good. Oh my gosh, you just found out you're pregnant um, with all the coronavirus going around and the shortages of items I'm going to need. Uh, you're feeling a bit stressed, is there any advice? Oh, Jay Garcia, congratulations on the pregnancy. That is amazing. Um, but yeah, I'm sure it's kind of like, oh, really? Like is now the time I get pregnant? <laughs> You're probably thinking, oh no, how am I gonna get the supplies? Uh, I think the thing is, at least in Australia, um, of course it's different around the world, but I think the thing is a lot of the shortages of items right now, it's not actually because of the virus or anything, it's just because people are freaking out and bulk buying stuff, so it will settle down. And also all the companies who make these items, they're gonna want to make as much money off that as possible. So there's gonna be, when there's been time for companies to make their products and deliver their products, there's gonna be way more of everything available. So I'm sure you'll be fine. Um, but I, I get what you mean though. You'd be like, oh, <laughs> oh no. Um, but like already, in Australia, like how much is this chair? 200, we can afford it. Oh, she needs like a beautiful chair in the corner. Oh my gosh, you're gonna be a mama seat as soon. That's so exciting. It's a mama seat. Ah. <laughs> it's a seat for mama. I might keep the yellow cushion. That's actually really sweet. So maybe we should, you know, kind of put these up high to begin with just like that. And I'm also really not feeling this wall. So let's maybe see what other colors we have. Also, I think there's a lot of other uh, mums in the chat who have good advice too, and dads who have some good advice. Again, everyone is in the same boat, so. Um, Yeah, there's plenty of people to talk to and get advice from, which is which is handy dandy. Okay, where is? I was gonna put like some blue stuff on the wall. Hmm. Oh, that's nice. Some leaf leaves. It's not the classiest looking room, but it is a nice retreat room. Maybe it's the bed that isn't really working for me. Maybe we go a white bedspread. <laughs> We're gonna take forever on this room, aren't we? With a slightly colored wallpaper, but then the curtains don't go, you know? It's, I'm gonna do something like this. It's a little bland. It's a little bland. 
There we go, that's what I'm looking for. <laughs> um, sorry, I've been looking away. Great, Full Anna, thanks for gifting a sub to Lauren. And Liza gets silly, thank you for sharing and being awesome. You've inspired me to do the 100 baby challenge. Yay! You're a wizard, Nancy has <laughs> just subscribed. Hello, you're a wizard, Nancy. Is everyone gonna start calling themselves, you're a wizard, so and so. Good names. Who is the palm tree paper by? Uh, this is by Cade and the Sims. Depaneled by Gloom Sims. Okay, so Gloom Sims depaneled the original and then Cade and the Sims added these swatches. Um, oh my gosh, Hannah, that's cute. Cressy, what's up? How are you doing? Uh, I'm due in just four weeks. Wow. Oh my gosh, watching the 100 baby challenge while you're pregnant must be a hoot, a trip. Uh, Michelle Brightside, thank you for subscribing. Uh, good to see you here. Oh, Katie, you have to get an MRI. Apparently they're a little like um, uncomfortable because they make sounds, but you can have something in your ear. So I can see why you're a little nervous, but just think of it as routine, you know? And it's really good that we have the technology of MRIs. So it's a good thing. It's a really good thing. Um, I was in a queue for toilet paper for like 55 minutes today. Oh my gosh. Oh dear. Okay, you're up to baby number 14. I better lift my baby making game. Gracious. How do you guys get in the, like, you guys just get through the challenge so quickly. I'm not feeling this window thing we have here. Well, I'm up to baby number seven. <laughs> and I think I'm still awesome, so yeah. Oh, let's add some pinks to the wall. Here we go. I just felt like she needed a little more oomph in the room, I suppose. There we go. I mean, it is plain, but it'll do. It's mama's room. Okay, now we've got to figure out what is happening here. We've got 6,000 smallings. We've basically done nothing for the kids, which is not the best. <laughs> uh, we really put ourselves before our kids, which is great. We do need a new dining area and the bathroom situation. So let's maybe think practically and we'll put the bath shower unit that you guys suggested. Uh, we could probably just use this one, 845. Hygiene six, reliability five. Let's get this one, it's worth, it's worth the markup, I think. We can extend this a little bit too. Just wanna make it look a little nicer. Cause... Oh, actually I don't even like how this is looking. The kitchen space needs help. Why is this? Oh, that's right. We have like an outdoor shower thing. We don't need this anymore. Because we've got the the public restrooms for the kids. They have to use the public restroom. Uh, because there's so many of them. It's basically like dealing with the public. The amount going in and out. Let's maybe put some nice tiles in here. Mm. Don't forget to stock the Wonka family house with toilet paper. Thanks, Stress Art. I will remember that. Uh, Nick Cut, thanks for subscribing. And Northlight, thank you so much for subscribing as well. And Diamond Siani, thanks for subscribing. You guys are coming in. Uh, Double BB496, thank you for the bits. And Megboz, thank you for subscribing. And Michelle Brightside. And Janae Dotson, thank you as well. Um, thank you so much. You guys are seriously awesome. I feel loved. I feel loved and special. 
special, so special. <laughs> na, 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 na. Okay, I'll shut up. Now let's get another unit here. Oh yeah, I feel like, don't forget the toilet paper. I feel like this is looking a little cleaner, you know? It's, it's a little more aesthetic on the eye. We'll just do a little mirror for now. I know it's not ideal, but you know, we gotta just keep it, keep it chill. Uh, then let's get a little rug. Maybe something along these lines, or maybe this one. This is like the old trusty, you can't go wrong with this. And I swear there was a navy blue color. Oh yeah, that, because it kind of, you know, it's like pattern on pattern. It's chaos. We don't want chaos in this house, I've decided. <laughs> Aborting that situation, let's just get a plain one that's yellow. You know what? Let's just not do that. Let's just keep it as is. Can probably put a plant in here too. And we'll put some towels in. Get like a little little towel rack there. Like that. Um fabulous Elliot. 2004, thanks for subscribing. And Chini Sapien, thanks for subscribing as well. And Lindy Laura too, wow, coming in with the Prime subs. And Peachy Thing, wow. And Alita J, thanks for the bits. Hi, Finch Toast, so, 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 so. The kids can throw down towels if they really want rugs. It's just how people roll. There you go, I love it. You know, keeping it simple and effective. This plant is a little, potentially overkill. Maybe we should do this little, I don't know if citrus really works in a bathroom, but we're gonna go for it anyway. Okay, now we've got 5,000 simoleons and a very odd floor plan corridor. This definitely needs to be expanded. I think I'm gonna cut this tree down. I'm so sorry, I'm usually not one for cutting things down. But we need to expand, people. I'm thinking this could be the dining quarters, like here. Which means we could finally put this cauldron inside. <laughs> Lindy Laura, thanks for subbing. Um, I think I got my Prime to work, but I don't know how to use the free subscription. I actually don't know exactly how you do it. Maybe someone in chat can help because I've never uh, used it before, unfortunately. Put this over here. Mama Cedar's really got her life together these days. It's really impressive. Remember when we had the baby farm and it was just like, oh my gosh, so hard. Maybe the crib should just be here. I feel like that's not a good spot for a crib. We can put, oh no, that's a, that's an even worse spot for that. This is where our desks are. Wow, we must have been so stressed when we placed these desks because they do not go with the rest of the room at all. <laughs> a couple of desks here. I hate that full length mirror in the hallway, really. What happens if we put it in the bathroom? Will it make you feel better if we go like this? There you go. Um, I'm not really a fan of that. I feel like we could get some nicer windows. Like still cheap, cause you know, we're cheap, but can make them a little nicer. Hope you have a great rest of your day. P.S. Try not to run out of toilet paper. Thank you, little kitty. Have a good day. Um, Deli apologized for cutting down a pixel tree. I did. I felt bad. Save the trees. <laughs> I'm also going to put this in the kids' lounge room, which we will renovate at a later stage. This is this. This is sad. This is just 
I don't know what to say about this. Is this a windowless room? Why are there... Damn, what have we been doing with our lives? Okay, let's just at least put some windows in, because... Goodness gracious. <laughs> it's just chaos. Um, we can leave these beds as they are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I mean, that's okay, right? How long will I be streaming for? At least a couple of hours, I would say. At a minimum, a couple of hours. I feel like these are really nice to see, the school projects kids have done. So I think we should maybe kind of put them in our living area. Because we have several of them, don't we? Like we could put one in the corner over here. That might be nice. That might be nice for people to see when they come in the home. Oh, we could do like a little shelf thing down here. You know, what's in our inventory? Get rid of those. That's money that Mama Sita needs. I feel like Mama Sita would be the biggest hustler. Like she's just like hustling all the time. She's really good with money. She's like, I don't need this but I will splurge on this. Like she is, oh, this isn't working. <laughs> she just like knows what's up, you know? Why can't I, what can I, what can I place this on? I need like a little surface. There we go, but that doesn't make me happy, that one. This makes me happy. Okay, we're just gonna have to lift it up then. It's like, yeah, this is what my kid made. It's really impressive. Like a couple of things over here. Right, it's not even that nice. Let's get something else. I actually think this door needs to go here. And we're gonna have to ditch that chair because we need like a hallway table. What time is it for me? It's three o'clock. <laughs> you napped in preparation for this stream? Nice one. Uh, Elry, thanks for subscribing with Prime and Aqua Tina, thank you so much for subscribing with Prime as well. And HBell12, thank you. Uh, and Hoppities, what's up? Thanks for resubbing for a massive 14 months. I'm glad to have made it to a stream, mate. Uni class has moved to online, so hopefully I'll be watching streams easier. Yay! I'll keep streaming for you. That's awesome. Um, let me see what else is in the chat. No, not the Mama Sita. <laughs> uh, the favorite kid gets their project displayed. I mean, if this is by Charlene, I'll scream. It's by Henrietta Wonka, you guys. That's nice. Can you imagine if it was by Charlene? I kind of feel bad for Charlene. She had a really rough time and she's actually not like a horrible sim. I mean, she was really hard to deal with, but she ended up being okay. Like she turned out all right. Who made this one? Oh, it doesn't actually say who made that one. What about this one? What? How did we see? Oh, I guess maybe multiple kids worked on these. So that's okay, we'll put this one up. Um, I usually watch this challenge on YouTube. Is it kind of weird watching it live when you've watched it on YouTube? It doesn't actually sit properly on this surface. Okay, there's a couple of projects. We don't want the same project again in here, so I'm just gonna whack that in the room that we'll renovate later. Oh, it feels so good to organize this place a little bit. It's been so crazy. <laughs> uh, Golden Hawk 97 thank you so much for subscribing with Prime. And Curly Q, what's up? Oh my gosh. Uh, thank you so much for subscribing for 45 months. Not Charlene. Not Charlene. Hey, Curly. Thank you so much for the amazing support. It's so good to see you. I hope you're doing well. Did I watch Claire's 100 baby challenge? She did it in a day. 
I actually didn't, but I did see that she did the challenge in a day, which is very impressive. I don't know how though. That's cooler. I, I'm impressed. Should we continue the leaf pattern? I mean, that's quite nice. Good, nice. I'm really go with the gray though, so. She's a little bit obsessed with the leaf pattern. I think we're better off putting some like nice feature walls like this in. Not that one though. Mm -hmm. Something like this maybe. Okay, I'm worrying too much about this. We're focusing too much on it. What else do we have out here in the snow? Uh, I've got some books here we can put on a shelf. Got some lights that we probably don't need anymore. Got another plant here. I might just pop that on that shelf. Beautiful painting to put in the rumpus room. Welcome, Lil J Phoenix, to your first stream. Hope you enjoy it here. What do you think about making the bathroom smaller for more kitchen? I mean, we could make it a little smaller. But nah, I think we should keep it spacious. I mean, we need to gradually make this bigger. I actually want to expand this hallway so it's like there. But I don't really want to spend the money right now, so we'll keep it as a hallway here. What we can do though is move the front door. That would probably make sense. And to actually have a nicer front door, that's a little more of a front door moment. Something like this. You know, it's like too big for this space though. <laughs> but at least it's like this is the front door. That's actually quite cute too, in a weird way. Uh, Mim Sims, thanks for the 100 bits. And Truth and Beauty, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Gold Dice. Uh, that's that's beautiful. And Golden Hawk, thanks for subscribing. Poor Shali, never stood a chance. All she wanted was her mom's attention. I know Fumbelina, but she just went about it the wrong way. Charlene had a lot of problems. And I wish her all the best, I really do. Sell the crib, you get a free one at hospital with the next baby. Now you're thinking, Michelle. <laughs> Welcome, Sammy. Uh, hey, Deligracy was wondering if you're ever going to upload Florence to the gallery. Um, haven't I? I should check on that. I think I'm behind on uploading a few things. How many children so far? We've only done seven kids. We're just currently renovating uh, the house. Mama Sita needed a bit of me time and uh, a little bit of renovation time. Uh, now that she's, you know, she's done the hardship, she's had a lot of babies, you know, it's time for the house to get a little bit organized before we do the next round of kids. So, um, yeah, it's, it's going really well. The kids are doing great. The kids are just doing wonderfully. Charlene's moved out. So has Henriette or Harriet, forgot my kid's name. And yeah, the kids are just great. Oh my gosh, we should take them on a holiday at some stage to like camp or something. I know technically in the rules you're probably not allowed to, but come on, we need to treat our kids to a holiday when we can afford one. I'm gonna make the cauldron out, sit out here, I think. What is this? Oh, it's a flower, that's nice. Well, let's put this here. This is like the little outdoor cauldron area. I'm thinking baby basement is something you need. Putting the babies in the basement, really? That almost seems too too cruel even for me to do to my sims. <laughs> I was telling mom about my baby farm and she's like, but they're just babies. And I was like, I know mom, but it's just the sims, it's okay. And mama deligracy, mama deligracy did not appreciate the baby 
uh, what was it that we did? The baby barbecue video. She's like, I think you should take that one down, Maddie. It's just, they're just a baby. And I was like, I know, but mom, they're Sims. It's okay. And she's like, I don't know. <laughs> I finally checked out Dr. Gluon because of you and someone from there gifted me a sub. So much love. Yeah, Dr. Gluon, golly gee, he's awesome. We'll probably raid him after this stream. So you guys can see him in action. Can probably afford a rug. Aw, Tessa, that's so sweet. Yeah, my real name's Maddie. Oh my gosh, Curly, what are you doing? Curly just gifted 10 subscribers. Curly, you're out of control, woman. <laughs> Holy subs, right? Wow, Curly. Oh my gosh, you're such a big supporter of this channel. Not only does she give up her time to mod, she then gifts all of these subs as well. You're nuts. Thank you so much. Um, DM Reigns, Casey Bunny Princess, Betty Bob Plum, Indiana B, Horsekel06, Underscore Ma, a uh, Sibyl, Lil Tino, Shana Silk, and D3 Anod 3 Anno. Welcome to the Pickle family. And let's give some snaps in the chat for Curly and 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 Woohoo Love. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. Curly, what the truck? <laughs> Thank you. What does she have to say in the chat about herself? I gave James 10 the other day. It's certainly fair. Oh my gosh. Oh, feeling the love today. Uh, Victoria P 1992, oh, 992, thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the Pickle family. And Alio Fasgard, thanks for subscribing with Prime. Really appreciate it, you guys. And I made a cupcakes, thanks for the bits. That is awesome. And Kahal95, thanks for subscribing. And Mim Sims, thank you for the 100 bits. Truth and Beauty YouTube, thank you for gifting a sub to Gold Dice. That is very lovely of you. Um, but you're not so, so you guys. Truth and beauty, I just shouted you out, right? Yes, and Golden Hawk 97 thank you for subscribing. And Ellery, thank you for subscribing. And Aquatina, thank you for subscribing. <gasps> She's trying to kill me of just like, oh my gosh. If someone wants to do my statistics homework as a thank you, I won't say no. I mean, I would love to try, but I don't think I know how to do that homework. <laughs> Maddie is a pretty name. Thank you. It's uh, Madeline, spelled Madeline. Sunflower Girl, thanks for the 400 bits. That's lovely. And Tom Cub, thank you for the 100 bits as well. And Elry, what are you doing? Gifting five subs. Thank you. Uh, Thank you so much for gifting a sub to Sweetberry Muffin, S subs, Genie826, Yilling1996, and Grace Million. I am overwhelmed. I am so overwhelmed. Oh my gosh, and now there's more gifted subs. What are you trying to do, you guys? I can't cope. You're so nice. Oh. Uh, Kahol95, thank, 9095, thank you so much for gifting five subs as well. Um, thanks for gifting a sub to Jemami, Paris Emerald, Tinny Tin Tin, cute name, uh, M Garcia2218, and The Crime of Juliet Tahara. Thank you so much. You guys are so generous. Uh, and Sunflower Girl, thank you for the 400 bits. Damn, I can't. Can we get extra snaps in the chat? And if you don't have snaps, uh, just some love in the chat would be great. Oh my God, cannot deal. Petalbrook, thank you for the 100 bits. Damn, people are so nice. Oof. 
I love seeing all the snaps. Oh, you guys are the best friends ever. You make me so happy. Ugh. Oh no, you made me a little emotional. Jeez, pull yourself together, girl. <laughs> That's really sweet. Um, I'm just gonna add a little bit more kitchen here. Look at all those snaps. <laughs> HBell12, thank you for gifting a sub to Megatron. And Alita J, thanks for the 1,000 bits. Thank you so much. Uh, hey Deli, this is my first stream on your channel. Welcome. You can try an angled wall in the bathroom to allow for easier flow. The desks could also go in the kids' hangout. Actually, that's quite a nice idea. We should try that. That'll look, yeah, that looks really nice. We can put the hand towel over here. I wouldn't mind a proper fridge as well. <laughs> I mean, as much as the mini fridge is iconic, could we afford a bigger fridge? I mean, this is a little nicer. We'll get some shelves up here. Uh, Jesse Dre, thanks for 100 bits. Uh, love you too, Lindy. Oh, hugging you from afar, is that sweet? Deli, delete the dirty counter, please. I think it will cost us to delete it, so I think I should keep it for now. I don't wanna like, Um, I want to keep our budget on, you know, doing okay. Do we want this microwave? I feel like we don't need a microwave. Mama Sita doesn't appreciate microwaved food. She's like against that, so. They don't have a microwave. Ooh, I like the terracotta. That's nice. We can have our plant here. We can have this painting leaning across here. I mean, we should probably have a range hood. We're actually doing pretty well with money in saying that. Can we put this in? Actually, better not. Um, maybe a range hood. Oh my gosh, you guys, I found out the coolest thing yesterday. Oh. Amberlynn, thank you so much for subscribing with Prime. And Cassie and Kian, thanks for subbing with Prime as well. Um, welcome to the pickle family. Yeah, I'll clean the counts when we go into live mode. Woolly Noodle is right. Um, I found out something really cool. So if you follow me on Twitter, you, might, you may have noticed last night I tweeted, um, does anyone have any like good at home exercise ideas? or like things you can follow. And someone said, oh, you know, you can get Les Mills on demand. And Les Mills uh, is the guy who created my gym classes that I used to go to. I used to go to body attack classes. I used to get up at 5.30 in the morning to go to them and then I gradually got out of, I couldn't sustain that um, discipline to go so early in the morning. So I stopped going and I was really sad, but then I found out you can go like order this watch it on your TV and do the classes from home. So I got that and I did it last night for the first time in months. And I literally only got through two out of eight tracks <laughs> that I used to do two or three times a week. And I was like, oh my gosh, how did I do this? <laughs> but it was really good. I'm really excited to try it again. So that was pretty cool. How much did I just spend on this? Oh, 245, that's not too bad. Oh, there, I'm not really feeling it there. We could put one of the desks against the wall, you know. I, I don't mind that idea. We should probably get a sink too, and a bin. Do a black sink there. And we'll put the tiles over here and put the wallpaper here. It's good. And then the other computer can go in the rumpus room, which is a mess right now, but that's okay because it's really temporary. Deli, the Nike training app is free and so great for at home workouts. Oh, does the Nike training app have like 
at-home classes. There's meal plans. Is it an eight fit app for your phone? That's cool. Uh, Petra Cora, thanks for subscribing. And Lissy Tab, thank you for the 100 bits. Appreciate that a lot, you guys. Uh, and Amblin, thanks for subscribing. And Cassie and Kian, thanks for subscribing. I feel like we're definitely going to have... Oh, I've been dropping a few frames. Um, I feel like we definitely might have space for new emotes. So we need to think about new emotes too. Hoppities. Hey, Hoppities. Nike Training Club has at-home workouts, usually 15 to 30 minutes each. I had no idea. Uh, Jenslinger, how are you doing? Some of the workouts require weights. I've got some weights. Yeah, I just feel like I've been so out of shape recently, and I really need to, like, get back into disciplining myself a bit. Also, Claire's getting married, and I... You know when, if you have a friend who's getting married, you kind of feel like you want to... You know, if there's an event or any event, really, you just want to use that as some motivation. Like, I don't know when she and Ali will plan their wedding, but I'm like, I'll use that as motivation. <laughs> that would be nice to have in the chat, at least. What's that? Toilet paper. <laughs> I'm in the same boat. Yeah. No, nah, it's just a matter of being disciplined and getting back into it, and you feel better so quickly. If that was an emote, that would be cute. Move bathroom for more room. We could ex we could even open this, actually. How much is that? That's actually not too bad. See, we can go like this. We could even create a little fenced off area for this. Kind of, so it feels like it's a little more organized. I don't mind that. Um, Amberlynn, thank you for gifting a sub to Shah Gardner. That is very sweet of you. Welcome, Shah Gardner. Thanks, Amberlynn. And Stick Girl 4, thanks for subbing. And Mickenum, thanks for subscribing. I asked James the other day, he has plenty of toilet paper. He can send it to you. I'm actually okay for toilet paper. Thank you guys. Thanks for the concern. Uh, so I, from being lactose intolerant, I always have too much toilet paper. It's like the one thing I always have heaps of. So I'm actually all good. So um, thank you for your concern there. But you girls got the toilet paper covered. Although my sister's been, oh, actually no, Olivia hasn't really been using my bathroom. She uses her own bathroom. Ah, uh, she lives close by. She doesn't like have her own bathroom that she walks around with. <laughs> oh, imagine that. Maybe that's what will happen. We'll all have our own bathrooms, bathrooms. You know, it's kind of crazy that they haven't designed a, Actually, what am I doing? I want this one. They haven't designed like a personal carry bathroom. You know, why is it not a thing that we just pee in our handbags? Why is that not a thing? Because that would be so practical. But why do people not do that? You know, obviously, because society would think it's unhygienic and weird. But with our smartness, we could have created that, right? You know? Am I crazy? A, a colostom colostomy bag? Yeah, exactly. You know, why isn't that just a normal thing that everyone has? It's called a shovel. I don't think that's that crazy. It's a great idea. Uh, Mixed at 26, thanks for subscribing with Prime. Whenever I take my dog out, I wish I could pee outside with her. Exactly. I've thought the exact same thing. <laughs> Because at the end of the day, humans are so impractical because we're so full of ourselves. We're like, oh my God, that would be so embarrassing. Oh my God, I would never do that. Like, why are we like that? Is that even smart? I don't think so. By 2020, we'll have flying cars. No, we're teaching people how to wash their hands. <laughs> so true. 
Most British thing ever. I went to the shop last night to pick up some things. Yes, a full pack of toilet rolls was included. And the tea was nearly out of stock. Heaven forbid we go without tea. Okay, I, I'm sure that's a British thing because the tea aisle's fully stocked in Australia. <laughs> uh, it's interesting seeing what different countries are buying out. I mean, it's not funny, but it is a little amusing, okay? It's a little amusing at times. Okay, is there anything else we have around the place to put on these shelves? The playroom is so sad. Let's at least get some colorful carpet in here. Like, how much is this? We can at least put this inside. Uh, why do I keep going for so many pinks? I kind of like, whoa, I was gonna say, I kind of like the yellow, but not that yellow. Let's just make it a little more happier in here because it feels really dever. Okay, there we go. It's a little yellow, but it's okay. America's out of toilet paper and meat. Italy is out of pasta. Uh, Ka XO, XO, thank you so much for subscribing with Prime. Welcome to our pickle family. Oh, you're right, Rachel. Um, I don't think you can clean a, s a counter with a sink in it. That's a good idea. Let us rearrange this. Let's put that there. Put that there. Wait. What did I just do? Why is it suddenly clean? Did I accidentally delete it? I don't even know what I did then. I did something bad. Don't worry, we get 10 we get 10% rebate. It's all going to be fine. Oh, what? We can't put a sink in there either. Well, where's me sink going to go? <laughs> Where's me sink gonna go? Hey, maybe we can afford a kitchen island. Now this is what I'm talking about. Yo, my name is Deli. Rub my belly. You wanna be jelly of my helicopter. Can you guys hear the song? Cause otherwise that's really awkward. Yo, my name is Deli. Rub my belly. You want to be jelly of me in my heli? Kata. <laughs> no sink, money making garbage. You guys can't hear the music. What? You can't hear the music? Oh no. <laughs> what? You can't hear the music in the background? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, it glitched when I moved it. Okay, as long as we didn't spend unnecessary funds, I'm happy. Okay, you can hear. <laughs> that was quite funny, wasn't it? Uh, this, I really like my deli song to this tune. I'll sing it again for you guys in the back. Also, this doesn't really work because it's too long for the rest of the kitchen. I feel like it's not gonna really work. It's really loud now? Oh, okay. What about there? Deli, stop spending your money. Okay, I'll just do this then. I'm trying to make it look pretty. I'll just put this one here real quick. There we go. No more. So I thought these tiles might look really nice if they were blue. Just to add a little bit of something into the room. The kitchen looks better than the kids' bedroom. Yeah, well, the kids are just kind of, you know, this is their situation right now. Maybe we'll do gray in there, that's quite nice. Um, monkey 
bars. We'll maybe put the school projects in here so they can work on them in there. Now, is there anything else that's a bit of a hot mess? This is a little bit of a hot mess. Uh, we could probably put that in here so they can help themselves to food. And maybe we can actually make this into a little adjoined dining area. Maybe if we get the one that was in the free update, that could be nice. You know, this one. Uh, we can probably keep, no, we won't keep the outdoor one. Can we like kind of join that up? Oh, there we go. We can have a bit of red and blue. There's that little dining area. That's like, maybe put the bin over here. Yeah, nice. Little communal space. Mama Cedar's making this into a home, you guys. And damn, it looks fine. I know why we're going with this like red theme. For some reason, it looks really kid friendly to me. Put that there. Um. What do we want to do a poll about? Oh, are we doing a poll? Are we going to have more teamers babies or are curious? I'm not sure, we'll look at that soon. Oh, you're blocking the door with the project? No, there's the door. And then there's the door for the bedroom. And then this door's over here, so that should be fine. And then in here, that's fine. Um, I'm a wonton. Thank you so much for gifting another sub to Min Ayer, Mini Al. Welcome, Mini Al. And Care Kiss Hug Kiss Hug, thank you for subscribing with Prime. It's very caring of you. You're blocking the door with the school project. Which one? What school project? I'm a sub big day, get a shout out. Mini Al, shout out to you. <laughs> Thanks to I'm a wanton for gifting you a sub. Yes, poll time, my first. Okay, what should we do a poll about then? I love that you guys are like, we want a poll. <laughs> you know, you ask, you receive. The door to the rumpus room? Oh, okay, so I moved them out of the way. It should be fine now. Uh, Dai Young, thank you so much for subscribing. Do a poll about doing a poll. Should we do a poll? <laughs> this is like, this can be the business area over here. This is where we make our money. Uh, I'm also kind of wanting to put a little bit of fencing around because I feel like people are going to want to steal our crops. Okay, no, that costs way too much money. No more fencing. We'll put a fence around the property when we can afford it. What is this? A trash plant. I want that. I've got our cute little letterbox. We got, oh, we got a little toilet. I don't really want this toilet in the main area. It can be in the kids' quarters. Toddlers will sleep in a chair. Who needs a bed? Oh yeah, we do need to get some toddler beds. That's true. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do, 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 do. Drop it. I always thought I could maybe be a D, maybe be a DJ. Nope. Would you guys come to a club if I was like, I'm headlining a club in your city. Would you guys actually come to it? Is this in the front party in the back? That's right. 
Welcome, uh, Nora, to your first stream. We must stop meeting in the middle of the night. Like, this my day. <laughs> what? Uh, one of my favorite builds is the abandoned home reno you did a few months back. Oh, really? That's good to know. Deli Club, yes please, absolutely. That's good to know. I'm glad that I could always DJ and tour uh, as another as another thing. But I bet you I'd be like, all right, let's go everyone. Oh, sorry, technical difficulties. Sorry, everyone. <laughs> what would my DJ name be? It would be, uh, what would my DJ name be? Mmm. The Jelly. Because it's like DJ Deli. Deli? The Jelly. And then in my songs it, or my mixes, it'd be like. The Jelly! <laughs> <laughs> you and Dr. Gluon's DJ party would be so good. I feel like it would be. Tablet. It would be great. I don't like this stinky potty. Okay, we still have $1,600 left to do something with. Uh, question is, do we want to do something with that money or not? Just like these curtains. Mind some lighting. I know it's unnecessary. Like, should we do anything to the kids area or not really? You know, it's hard. It's hard to know what to do. Bills, we don't have any bills. A water slide? Maybe we could. Like, I feel like we've got a much nicer kitchen. We've got a much nicer bathroom, a much nicer bedroom for Mama Cedar. Uh, oh, we've got to fix up the roofing. That is, whoa. That's a little bit of a worry. I think we'll do a complete re-roof. Doesn't cost anything to do that. Let's go like this. Bring that back. Very nice. Um, Paul Fidelli's next hair color. Oh, guys, you know me. I only do my natural hair color. I know I'm not exciting like all the other. Well, I'm not a real gamer girl, apparently because everyone has their hair dyed with cool colors, but not me. Not little Deli Welly. Deli and her wellies. Okay, let's just. Now this just looks weird, doesn't it? Now we need to move the door over because of the roofing. Can we even do that? Oh dear. Let's see if we can fix this. It's just, it's just not how I wanted it to be, you know. It does look like quite a nice house, though. Like, it looks very warm and inviting. Neighbors would be like, wow, did you see that lady down the road? She has seven kids! I know, I always see them outside playing. I don't know how she does it. Well, what I've heard is that they call her the Mama Cedar because she's amazing. I know, but did you hear what happened to Charlene last weekend? Oh my God, I heard. Apparently she just lost her, like she just went crazy at the club. Like she just started going crazy and said she wanted to beat up this girl who kissed the same boyfriend as her. I mean, same guy as her. It was so crazy, I know. Uh, that's what people would talk about. <laughs> Get a better bed for the kids? Aw, oh, thanks, Dark Fairy. Baby Five, thank you so much for subscribing. And Sea Glass Green, thank you for the 500 bits. That's very generous. Thank you. Uh, Juliana A, thank you for subscribing. Stobby Rich Bums, I know. Charlene wears Uggs to the club. She sure does. 
Charlene, she'll probably be back home soon. I mean, I'd love to see Charlene again, personally. I miss her. As much as we rip on Charlene, I do miss that girl. <laughs> I love your little character stories, thank you. Double beds, more space. Oh, what happened here? Well, that's a little bit of a worry, isn't it? It's maybe... Okay, maybe go like this. A little odd looking, isn't it? Hmm. Definitely needs to be blended into the build a little bit more nicely. Thank God we don't have to pay for roofing, am I right? Let's go like that. Let's get a little, a little something around the edges. Oh, don't do this to me. Oh, it's gonna poke out the edge there. It's so frustrating. Okay, that's probably the best we could do. Um, Bayfade5, thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome. And Amsita, thank you for extending your subscription through April, which is my birthday. Give the kids keys. Uh, see ya, Madisa. What's, uh, Mad see ya, Maddie. Oh, Maddie Sima. And Amberlynn, thank you for gifting a sub to Steph Funny. I appreciate that. I would love to know how you coordinate clothes with colored hair. I wouldn't know how to do it. <laughs> Can you show the family tree? I miss the other streams. I will I will have a look, and I know some of you guys are wanting the kids to have a nicer bathroom. I feel like the kids need a nicer bed before the bathroom, but I'm so glad that we actually have a little bit more structure right now. That is really making me very happy. We need to get rid of that garbage plant though. Uh, okay, so we've got the trees, we've got this back area done. I might do a yellow feature wall in here real quick, just to brighten up the space. Got that computer. Maybe we get some better beds and we carpet the bedroom. Maybe that's what we do. We can do like a half timber. situation like this. It's very plain. It's not the most exciting room. But that's okay. We're getting there. It's definitely all about, you know, making progress bit by bit. This door can stay. This is fine for now. I'm gonna update a few of the beds there with the little bit of money we have. Um, had that exact conundrum when she dyed her hair blue and then realized she was going to do a hen's do in three days time. It actually isn't that hard to coordinate with blue hair. Oh, really? I'm excited for the kids section to have a bathroom. Me too. We'll get there. Uh, Goldilocks, thank you so much for subscribing. And Mim Sims, thanks for the 400 bits. And Ranch47, thank you for gifting a sub to Squishy Mo Mocky. Squishy Mocky, that's so cute. And Ladies Kennedy, thanks for the 100 bits. And Amberlynn, thank you for gifting a sub to Steph Funny. And Bayfay5, thank you for subscribing too. Um, with my red hair, I can't wear green anymore. And I used to love green on me with brown hair. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like it would restrict you sometimes. How does this challenge work? All I know is you have to have a lot of kids. There, you have to have kids with a different dad every time and you can't age up a baby until it says it's their birthday. Then you can't age up a toddler until you get three skills to level five or five skills to level three. However, we're just playing at three skills to level five. Oh no, three skills to level three. Then kids, they have to get an A in school then teens can't move out until they have both an A in school, or they can't age up until they have an A in school. 
and they've also got a character value in the green, like top green section, and then they can move out of home. And then when your mama Cedar dies, then your youngest female becomes the mom, I think. So there are a lot of rules. You reckon CC beds? The, the only CC single bed I have is this, and it's 1,000 simoleons. So right now, they've got energy four. So if we want to up it, we can le level up our handiness skill. I reckon we could get these space blanket beds. We could get, oh, we can only really get one. Dude, that's so depressing. We can't like afford anything. How can we just save our money? We could get some more toys actually. Oh no, we don't need more toys. We could get a couch. Let's get a proper couch. How about that? How about that? I'll put this here. We'll get a proper couch and then we'll have to continue saving at least 10,000 before we can redo the kids area. But at least this area can look a little happier, you know. Lots of primary colors in here. This teddy bear doesn't go with the room. <laughs> Is that what some of you parents do? Like, you're like, oh, these kids' toys don't go. I need to get rid of them and buy it in my color. <laughs> to match the color theme of my room, of my house. I'm Cedar, thanks for the 100 bits. And History Nerd, thank you so much for subscribing. And Mason Wonder, how are you doing? Thanks for resubbing for a massive 22 months. Well, oh, actually 26 months. It's been a while since I've been able to catch a stream. Glad to be here now. I'm very glad to see you, Mason. Oh my gosh, this is the first stream you came to and you got gifted a sub. Very lucky. I wish we got more kids stuff. Mm. Minial, you've had two shout outs. You've had two shout outs. So here's your third and last shout out. Thank you for subscribing. And I believe you were gifted a sub. So I um, hope you're enjoying this stream and heard your, heard your third shout out. <laughs> uh, and thank you so much, Kata Sim, for gifting a sub to Courtney Cable 74. Thanks, Kata Sim, that's lovely. Uh, very generous of you this stream. And Goldilocks, thanks for the 300 bits. Uh, also, Kelly's putting the official rules in the chat, so that's great. Okay, I think we should save this and continue on. Okay, I might actually have a tinkle. Yeah, I need to have a tinkle before.